Hey everybody. Um, I've been I actually experienced a problem with my daughter's next book 10.1. I've had the same problem with mine before and it looks like in doing my research a lot of people end up having the same trouble that the tablet will go to sleep or it'll power down or in some way shape or form turn off and even after doing a full charge no matter what, hitting the power button, trying to do re, uh, reset on it, none of it seems to work to bring the tablet back. So, I actually found out how to correct this, and that's what I'm going to show you right now. So, all I did, well, I'll show you here, it's the next book. And what I did was I removed the back cover, and all you have to do is go all the way around the edge. Oh, get out here, see it. Go all the way around the edge. I used a pocket knife. It's not that hard to take off, but you just kind of go between the edge of the plastic part and the metal part around the edge here. This little tiny lip. I'll see if I can get close to it. That little tiny lip right there, and you just kind of get the blade in there, turn it sideways, or if you have better tools than me, whatever gets it separated. So you're sitting here looking at the inside, the guts of the tablet. <coughs> Excuse me. And the part that we're going to be focusing on, which I'll zoom into here. By the way, I think these are the battery packs. And... Try to get focused in here. See if it'll focus. There we go. It is that little white connector? It has two red wires, a black wire, or two red wires, a white wire, and two black wires. And over top of it is like a little piece of yellow tape. So what I'm going to do, let me turn this around so I can see what I'm showing here. Okay. So we're going to focus on that. Without trying to touch anything else, I just lifted the yellow tape off. And be careful because there's a lot of little ribbing cables in here. I don't want to try to tear anything apart. Get back in view there. And you take and just push something against the connector here to release it. It may take a little finagling. I have large fingers and it's hard for me to do any of the kind of small work here. But you can see it's starting to come out. And it looks like we have it. There we go. It's disconnected. So you just relieved, released all the power from the system right here. Leave it out for a couple of seconds. And plug it back in. And this doesn't affect any of your data or anything you have stored on it. And when you push it in, make sure you secure it pretty good. And then you put the yellow clear tape back over top of it. Make sure it stays protected. It's there for a reason. And uh, zoom back out here. That's our youngest yelling in the background. She's not very happy right now. And when I put it together, I try to start with the bottom side, which has the little dock for the keyboard on it. Because those are the only ones that kind of stick out of the 
tablet. The rest of them kind of match up pretty well. And then you just work your way around and just push it back together. Some places are a little bit tough to get back in there. But you can hear it snap back into place. And just go around twice. Like right here. I don't know if it's hard to tell or not. But you can kind of see the gap right there and you can see where it's supposed to be snapping in on the inside I don't know how well that shows across the camera little places like that you may have to try to lift up on the edge just a little bit to kind of make it go over there there we go And upon doing that, you hold the power button down. And it comes on. There we go. Fixed tablet. So I hope somebody out there get some use out of this it from what I could find out the reason behind it was some kind of defect in the programming that puts it to sleep so I'd recommend uh, trying to find out how to go through the control panel and anything that says sleep I would tell it to either do nothing or shut down versus go to sleep because going to sleep is what causes that issue to happen from what I've read and I haven't seen any other fixes to this online so that's why I decided to go ahead and post it so hopefully some very angry Nextbook users can rejuvenate their tablets back to life with that being said I uh, hope it comes to great use of you. Uh, let me know down in the comments. Like, subscribe. I'm all the time throwing random stuff out there. Uh, I think that about does it. So, everybody out there in YouTube land, have a great day. I'll catch you later. Be good.